Hey, good afternoon, Bocheros. We're your host uh, from Bochos Granja. And today we're going to talk about the American Job Center of California and the information they provided to us for the unemployed. Uh, unemployed. So let's get started. So last time we were talking about uh, me getting a notice for being laid off. It's coming October 12th, 2017. And uh, today at work, uh, we had uh, the program survey or whatever you want to call it. So let's talk about it. That's right. The American Job Center came over today. And the programs they offer are, are good, I guess you can say. So Elizabeth Mejia from the uh, Rapid Response American Job Center of California from Amani came over and talked about um, their programs. Her phone number is 626-258-0365 uh, extension 245 just in case you guys need uh, to communicate with her. So they talked about um, taxpayers, uh, taxpayer monies, um, all pay for, uh, what? Gosh, I don't even know my writing. All pay for, might as well use them for free. Oh, that's right, so for unemployment, um, all the taxes that they took from us, it's, it's uh, I guess it's taxes that we use for unemployment, I don't know. The TEA, Trade Adjustment Assistance, is a two-year training, wow, uh, 1974 to help Americans workers who lost their jobs as a result of um, increased imports. How much are you looking to get paid? Based on my resume, how much do you think I should receive? That's a question you would ask when you're on an interview. Also, Noel Johnson from ADD in West Covina, the work, uh, Workforce Service Branch, it's training, workshop, resume, and recruitment. So, yeah. They have a thing called the iTrain. It's i-train.org. Um, Alto Mendoza came from the EDD Unemployment in, uh, Insurance Benefits Program. He's um, in West Covina, I believe. The CTV, California Train Benefits. Attend approved school training and receive UI benefits. Ask about timing, uh, sorry, training when you file for, for your claim. Approved training programs. And you can check that at uh, labormarketinfo.edd.ca. And so, welcome to the rapid response training or session of it. And I'm not just going to talk uh, in detail about this uh, these items. I'm just going to go do a brief overview of them. So they have the rapid response. Uh, rapid response team provides information and service to help you identify community resources and find a job at no cost to you. They have the re rapid response sessions include, oh, sorry, I'm sorry. Rapid response sessions include representative from, representatives from American Job Center of, Amer of California formerly known as One Stop Career Centers, Employment Development Department Trade Adjustment Assistance, TAA program, and Department of Labor. They have the Workforce Innovation and Opportunity Act, which is the WIOA, WIOA. It's a federal le legislation designed to assist unemployment and underemployed Workers manage their careers by providing access to labor market information, training, and access to employers. The Wagner Payer Act, WPA, established a nationwide system of public employment offices known as the Employment Services. The act was amended in 1998 to make the Employment Service part of the America Job Center of California. 
formerly known as One Stop Career Center Service Delivery System. They have the Trade Adjustment Assistance, uh, which was established um, in 1974. It was a trade act to help American workers who lost their jobs as a result of increased imports or shift in production to foreign countries. And the website is www.doleta.gov front slash trade act altogether. Dislocated worker, a person who has lost their job through no fault of their own. That's me! American Job Centers California provides work uh, workforce information. American Job Centers of California provides Workforce Innovation and Opportunity Act, the WIL and Trade Adjustment Assistance TAA programs in information, career planning, skills assessments, resume writing and interview techniques, labor market information. The American Job Center of California provides continued job fairs and other job matching services, marketing workers, to area employees of proficient training. To the California Employment Development Department, Workforce Service Branch is the Labor Market Information Division, Disability Insurance Branch, and Unemployment Insurance Branch. The EDD's Workforce Service Branch offers Cal Jobs, special services for veterans and youth, Job searches, employees recruitment, computers for job searches. I mean, I have a computer here. I, uh, I do everything here. And they have a, a website. The caljobs.ca.gov. So they have a labor market information division. And I'll put here, I'll put that web address here on the screen for you guys. The Labor Market Information Division. Oh, that's two. The EDD's Disability Insurance Branch. The EDD's Unemployment Insurance Benefit Program. EDD's Unemployment Insurance Branch. Information, employment. Requirements for collecting unemployment insurance benefit payments. In order to receive continued weekly benefit payments, you must certify each week to receive payments. Weekly benefit payment requirements are a valid claim, which you can fill out and through their website at edd.ca and its um, UI. Physic uh, physically able to work, available, uh, available for work, active seeking work and working less than full time. Benefits are paid on a debit card that will be sent to claimants in the mail. So we talked about the UI online. Oh, it also gives you um, the form that you fill on the website or um, manually. And the one in on the bottom is the uh, cart they send you. Oh, this is a good one for you guys. Unemployment insurance and keep your home California. Programs are designed to help low and moderate income homeowners retain their homes. So if you have a house and you lost your job, then you can pay for your house for a set amount of months. You can apply for this and they'll help you out. I think it's about a year and a half, or yeah, a year and a half, which is 18 months, right? That uh, they'll help you with. And the thing about that, from what I understand in the class today, is that uh, you need to have a, um, you, you need to own the house for five years after the unemployment.
I'll be back. Sorry, I just noticed it was uh, a little dark. Hopefully that helps. At least helps you. So keep your home America. Uh, so keep your home California. It's uh, you need to qualify. You need to be unemployed. Unemployed mortgages assistance for up to three thousand dollars a month, as long as eighteen months. Uh, if you're behind your payments, mortgage rates reinstatement assistance program up to fifty four thousand dollars to catch up oh, wow that's pretty good unable to afford your payment or underwater underwater principal pr reductions program up to ten one hundred thousand dollars to do to reduce the principal of your mortgage wow now i wish i owned a house no longer a able to stay in your home Transition assistance program up to five thousand to help you relocate. Hmm? Pre uh, get pre qualified call for your free consult uh, counseling session. Uh, you can give them a call at eight hundred. I'm sorry. You can give them a call at eight 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 nine five two N H S. That's two six four seven. Um, unemployment mortgage assistance. Uh, the un the unemployment mortgage assistance program will make your monthly mortgage payment up to three thousand dollars per month, um, up to eighteen months, and monthly payments can include principal, interest, tra uh, taxes, and insurances. So that's pretty good. They have a covered uh, 2017 plan year info, which I'm pretty sure it's um, will change in 2018. So, what is Covered California? Covered California is an easy to use marketplace implementing the Federal Patient Protection and Affordable Care Act in California. And um, I'll leave more info on the, on the website. I'm sorry, on the links. I mean, I'll leave more info down below in the description. Plant benefits cost breakdown. Oh, I don't know that. So, the tax penalty for remaining uninsured. The shared responsibility payment is a new tax penalty that Americans have to pay this year if they can afford health insurance but choose not to buy it. Hmm. In 2017, the annual penalty in the greater is the greater of 695 for each adult and 347 for each child, up to 2,085 per family, or 2.5 percent of the tax filer's annual household income minus tax federal tax filing threshold, whichever is greater. Yeah, you get penalized for not having insurance. Go figure. So enrollment options, uh, no cost one on one enrollment assistance at 866-758-8377 or you can go to the website at coveredca.com. So call insurance, withdraw the cash value, what is this? Advantages, fastest way to receive your money, disadvantage, your money will not be there to help you when you retire, you will typically pay the highest percentage of taxes and penalties. And that's pretty much um, what they talked about today. Oh, look, here's their, this is the information for Elizabeth, um, sorry, I forgot her name. But you can you can you can contact her. Um, and another thing they gave us was uh, this little red uh, piece of paper, which are requirements that you need to bring in in order to um, uh, apply. Bring these documents to your first meeting. Meaning. For your interview, course service checklist, unexpected California. Oh, I'm sorry. 
unexpired California driver's license or identification card, original social security card, resident card, or work authorization card, passport, or certificate of naturalization. I have neither. Up to, um, no, I'm just kidding. I, I do have some of that stuff. Up to date personal resume and or call just resume. That's up there. Proof of selective service registration for men born on, on or after January 1, 1960. Verification printout from website. Yes. So here in California, you need to be uh, registered to go to work. If recently laid off, please bring layoff letter and or claim record, record and pay input printout, EDD. Vet veterans, bring your DD-214 for other veterans. Proof of possible income for the last six months, GR Social Security, TAF, unemployment, pay stats, spouse income, etc. Must have current month on documents. Um, let's see what else. So we talked about keep your home California. Um, well, we didn't talk about create your resume, but everyone else pretty much has a resume. And they give you a benefit booklet. And the, I think the benefit booklet helps you um, how to apply for the UI insurance let's see what else um, I'm um, I'm just gonna give you guys this info You can go ahead and pause the video if you like, if you need this info. Oh, we're centers by region here in California. Oh, and um, keep your home California, a little bit more of data. And um, that's pretty much it. Um, they, they, I mean, they, they told us pretty much what's what was gonna happen. Not literally. But this is all the information they give us for right now. Um, Come uh, October 12th, uh, I will need to apply for this programs or whatever I can apply for, and um, you know take it one step closer to my um, separation date. Awesome, I'm really. Anyway, um, well, hope you guys like this information. If you guys want to see. Um, have a PDF file of these uh, paperwork, uh, please let me know in the comments. I, I'll surely gladly um, get them in PDF format as soon as I have my scanner available uh, and ready for you guys um, when you guys need it. Um, please go ahead and like and share the video if you liked it and uh, subscribe to this uh, channel. And uh, thanks for Thanks for, you know, watching my channel once again. I'm sorry I'm short of words. I hardly talk to or talk. I don't like to talk much. But, you know, this, I, this is what's going on in my life right now. And uh, I'm really happy that you're um, watching this video. Um, if you feel uh, that uh, someone needs this type of information, please go ahead and share it with them. And, um... I was wondering also if you could uh, help me in my channel uh, just by watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. That'd be awesome.
as possible. Really appreciate it. Uh, well, that's it for right now, guys. Thanks again uh, once more for watching. And uh, I'll see you until next time. Ciao.